Another episode of Meet Malware. This time we'll be taking a look at a sample which was sent to me by a viewer. Before we proceed, I'd like to announce its formal name. It's called Adam Locker. As you might expect, it is a type of ransomware and uh, I seem to have caught on to a fairly new variant. So this thing comes disguised as an office invoice and uh, uses the typical double extension format. It's pdf.exe. The surprising thing is you find these things in Google Drive links. So um, Google clearly doesn't have this blacklisted. Imagine receiving a link like this in your mail. Most people would totally open it. And uh, the person who sent me this file actually did open it and ended up getting infected. But he mentioned that since he is a viewer of the PC Security channel, he had backups of his data. So he didn't have to thrash his monitor or keyboard or anything like that. First of all, um, I would strongly recommend that you do the same, have backups of your data, because you never know when you'll be struck by something like this. Once you click download, the fun starts, but, um, well, I'm not gonna do that on my real machine. That would be folly indeed. So I'm just gonna copy the link and let's try this out on a virtual machine and see what happens. The purpose of this video is to demonstrate the attack vectors that can be used to infect your computer and uh, show that ransomware really does infect you coming from an exe file online. A lot of people think that's not a realistic attack vector, trust me it is. So as you can see, um, this is a very simple ransomware and it asks you for 0.05 Bitcoin, it's just $50, so relatively inexpensive, but it does have a due date and let's see what it has done to our files. As you can see, it encrypts everything and renames it as itself. So you're pretty much going to reopen an instance of the ransomware whenever you try to open any of your previous files, and they're all appended with .atom. But it doesn't matter, sometimes this is all it takes to ruin your day. And as you can see, this file is just three days old. Once again, I hope you enjoyed this video. This is Leo from the PC Security Channel. Thank you for watching, and as always, stay informed, stay secure.